How's it going everyone? Phil here from Furious Technology. Today we are looking at the 2021 Trek Marlin 6. The one that you're looking at is in the Alpine blue color and it's a men's size large. The Marlin 6 is an entry level mountain bike and it sits one model below the Marlin 7 which is top of the line in the Marlin lineup. Stay tuned and I'm going to tell you exactly why the Trek Marlin 6 is one of the best all around entry level bikes that you can buy. The Trek lineup comes with a lightweight aluminum frame which Trek calls Alpha Silver Aluminum. It's a very well designed frame that has internal cable mounting so that none of the cables stick out underneath on the frame. So when you're traveling with this on your car or you want to store it in your garage, it's very easy to put up and you don't have to worry about damaging your bike brakes. The frame has a very beginner friendly head tube angle at 69.5 degrees as well as a seat angle at 73 degrees. The frame includes a rack and kickstand mount as well as two spots in the middle of the frame to mount water bottle holders. Moving on to some of the tech specs of the bike, the fork is an SR Suntour XCT30 fork with 100 millimeters of travel and a really nice feature of a lockout. The lockout allows you to go from riding on trails to on the road or if you want to go up hills, you have it locked out and you're not going to lose any momentum or power because of the movements of the forks. So it's really nice to have this lockout on there, which again makes it a very good all around versatile bike. The stock wheel sizes on the Trek Marlin 6 are very generous. The extra small and small frames have a 27 and a half inch wheel and the medium, large, extra large and extra, extra large include a 29 inch wheel. The larger wheel size makes it very easy for riding over things when you're on the trails and it makes it very comfortable when you're using it for road use. Another good thing you can do is put on more of a slick tire on this and it's a great on road use bike. The Trek Marlin 6 uses a 438 millimeter chain stay length. It has a 16 speed gear system that runs in a 2x8 format and it uses Shimano Atlas M310 rear derailleur, which goes to the Shimano HG31 11 to 34 cassette with a KMC Z8.3 chain to the Shimano M13 36 by 22 T crank set. For shifting the Marlin 6, it uses a Shimano Atlas M315 trigger shifter with a rapid fire shifting system. There's visual indicators as well to show which gear you're in precisely. For an entry level mountain bike, it's nice to know that this bike includes hydraulic disc brakes. The brakes are Tetro HD M276 hydraulic disc brakes and they use mineral oil for lubrication. They are a two piston caliber with 160 millimeter six bolt rotors front and rear. The front stem is a nice and wide Bontrager 31.8 millimeter alloy bar and stem. The grips are also Bontrager XR endurance comp grips which feature a flat spot for your palm. I personally find them very very comfortable to use. The saddle is also a Bontrager Arvada at 138 millimeters. It uses steel rails and has an aluminum 30.8 seat post with a quick removal latch. The tires are Bontrager XR2 comps and they are 29 inches by 2.2 inches on the medium frame and above. The rims are also Bontrager connections. The front and rear wheels of the Marlin 6 do have a quick release switch which makes it very convenient if you need to take off the wheels to travel or if you need to take them off for regular maintenance. The pedals that are included on the bike are just plastic with reflectors. I find them adequate for this type of bike but if you're going to do any crazy off-roading I would recommend upgrading your pedals. For the medium frame and up, the Trek Marlin 6 weighs 30.34 pounds or 13.76 kilograms. So it's not a super light bike, but it's also not overly heavy. In the description box below, I have linked five accessory add-ons that I highly recommend you get for your Marlin 6. Thank you for watching this video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. There'll be more Trek Marlin videos coming very soon.